Hey guys, it's Lanary, and I'm very bored, so today I'm going to show you how to make a walking stick. Now, walking sticks are good for a lot of things. For walking, decoration, um, for a gift, and um, I know that uh, Christmas just passed, and New Year's just passed. By the way, Happy New Year's! Hello, 2020! <laughs> and they're pretty much free to make. They're, in the, they're really easy to make, and they're fun. Fun. Now, first, what you need is um, like a saw, um, a limb, limb cutter, something like that. I'll show you mine. Now, make sure to use adult supervision when using these things. If you're using a saw, then you should definitely have a parent do that. Be safe, kids. Now, what kind of limb do we want? We could have any tree. Uh, birch. Oak, that's pretty much all I know. But you can have, like, any tree. But I f found out that the best tree to use is um, the evergreen uh, tree branch. So, first step is to find a good evergreen tree and find a good branch. So, I found the tree that I... I we, blah, blah, blah. So I found the tree that we can use. Look at this beauty. That's like regular branch, but like behind it. Little did I know that was a thorn bush. Ha ha ha. Yeah, yeah. Ah! Oops. There's a lot of thorns. Okay, I finally got the branch cut down. Now I just gotta remove the tiny little um, leaves and stuff that's poking out of it. All right, let's go back. So I got some scissors, so I'm gonna cut off the rest of those little branches. Come baby. wants to be in the video. Oh my goodness! Cutie! Okay, watch out. Okay. So, I finally cut off all the mini branches and stuff. And now I just gotta get a, uh, a butter knife. And you just kinda wanna like go under the skin or the bark, whatever it's called, and just kinda peel it off. See, kind of like that. See, I got some. And just peel it off. Yep. And just do that until you got the whole stick uncovered. See you then. I'm finally done. Uh, I didn't do a very good job. My hands hurt really bad. Um, I didn't like cut myself, but they just hurt. They're sore. But here it is in all of its glory, the walking stick. And there's a huge mess. Nice cleanup. Yay! Now, would I recommend getting this, uh, well, making this for, like, um, a gift or something? Yes, but no. Yes, because it's a pretty creative gift, and it's handmade. No, because it takes a lot of work, um, and you can risk getting cut, or it's pretty dangerous to make. And my hands hurt, and I re kind of regret this. But obviously, if you're like good at woodworking and making stuff, I highly recommend it. But I'm not, and and so 
comes out like this. I mean, it's actually not that bad, but I, I need sandpaper to sand it. And I didn't know we didn't have any, and I probably should have checked before the video, but I didn't. So here we are, an unsand walking stick. But I mean, in the winter, it could be used to break your animal, ha, ah, your animal's uh, water. I have something in my boot that just uh, stabbed me. So, thanks for watching. Look. What a cutie. Thank you guys so much for an amazing year. What a cutie. It's crazy. It's crazy to believe that just in February, I think, I started my YouTube channel and it like blew up. Well, not really. I actually took a break after I started my YouTube channel and then I went back to it and here I am now. It's crazy that I have 80 something subscribers. That's like just freaking crazy. Thank you all so much for sticking along to the adventure. And I can't wait to make many new videos in 2020. Thank you and have an amazing year.